creature comforts. You may have heard someone refer to physical comforts or modern conveniences as creature comforts. The hotel wasn't fancy, but it had all the creature comforts. A friend might be telling you about where she stayed during a business trip. Perhaps a friend has invited you to go camping. Sorry, I'm not the camping type. I value my creature comforts too much. It's hard to focus on making a better future for yourself when you don't even have all the basic creature comforts. You might hear while volunteering for an aid organization. As you can guess, creature comforts describes the things we need to feel comfortable, safe, secure, warm, pleasant, agreeable, relaxed. Creature comforts can describe the physical things we need or want, such as good food, heat in the winter, or air conditioning in the summer. It can also describe the actions that we take that make us feel good, such as getting a massage, taking a hot bath, or relaxing with a good book. These comforts, amenities, utilities, provisions, referred to on the whole are called creature comforts, while you can refer to just one as a creature comfort. The idiom creature comforts goes back to at least the 1700s a time when material wealth was increasing in the West and people became more focused on their physical, bodily comfort. After all, humans are animals or creatures, despite our intelligence and arrogance, and on the most basic level, have the same needs and wants as all other earthly creatures. Oftentimes, however, people become too focused on the pursuit of greater and greater creature comforts and end up neglecting more fulfilling things. such as creating something, appreciating nature, sharing love, serving others, or contributing to a good cause. I won't have all the creature comforts of home, but helping in remote rural villages will be very fulfilling. A friend might be telling you about her plans to volunteer abroad. Maybe you and your partner have decided to live a simple life in the mountains. Sure, there are a lot of creature comforts I miss, but our lives now are much more fulfilling. I work hard so that my family can enjoy all the creature comforts that money can buy. Your friend might tell you when you ask her why she works so much. So, the next time you want to talk about all the things that make you feel warm and restful, safe and secure, loved and cared for, relaxed and peaceful, don't forget that they're creature comforts. <laughs>